The report discovered that the Jakobshavn Glacier in Greenland isn't just not melting, but according to NASA's Ala Kazandar, it's growing. Between 2016 and 2017, uh, from two uh, separate NASA uh, airborne missions, we found uh, that near the front the glacier has thickened by uh, up to 30 meters. That's almost 100 feet in one year. Uh, and between 2017 and 2018, the same thing again. It's surprising because since 2012, the glacier has been steadily retreating, about 2.9 kilometers a year, thanks to climate change. But for the last two, it's been gaining ground at around the same rate. The reason? NASA scientists say it's likely because of a temporary cooling trend in Disco Bay, on the western coast of Greenland where the glacier meets the sea. Those cooler waters are allowing the glacier to grow again. What the measurements in the fjord where this glacier is have demonstrated is that when the glacier was retreating, the waters were quite warm and they were being fed by, by warm waters from the ocean. And when the glacier was uh, started to thicken, that warmth is no longer there. Now, it's not to say that oceans aren't warming, it's just the transfer of heat from the ocean to the face of the glacier has stopped. To be clear, the scientists involved in the study stress that this doesn't mean climate change isn't happening. It is. The Greenland ice sheet as a whole is still melting at record rates. But it suggests that ocean waters, which absorb most of the Earth's excess heat, are playing a bigger role in melting glaciers than previously thought. On the long run, it's actually bad news because uh, we demonstrate, this study demonstrates how sensitive this glacier and probably others in Greenland, how sensitive it is to ocean variability uh, and specifically, the, the, in particular, the temperature of the ocean. And studies show that ocean temperatures as a whole have been steadily increasing since about the 1960s. Yeah. Kevin Enix. VOA News.